in this section we need to send a couple of emails. In order to do this, I'm using my Gmail account. To compose a new message, click on Compose Mail. We're sending an email to design.h at cie.org.uk and the subject is November 2007. In the body of the message, we need four items name, center number, candidate number, and some text. Now we can send the message, and we should expect a reply very shortly. Click on Inbox to reload the inbox. And here's the reply. So click on the message, open it up, and as well as two attachments that we will use much later, it tells me to search the Hothouse website for this file. So Command T opens a new browser tab to the Hothouse design. The instructions were to download, so we need to search for a particular file. The file we're searching for is this. If I copy, paste the file name, here's the file download. Click on the link, and it's both downloaded the file into my downloads folder and opened it in text edit. I don't want it open in text edit, so I'm going to close that. Now, what's next? I want to prepare a second email message. So back to my email account, compose mail. This one's going to the same ad address. I want to copy it. So cc to hands.en, that's cie.org.uk, and blind carbon copy or bcc to other.an at cie.org.uk. Subject line ICT corrects. And body of the message. Next I need to attach the file I've just downloaded, so I click attach a file, now it's in my downloads folder, so I go to downloads, and the name was N7, N7 review, here it is, click open, now it's attaching the file, and you can send. Finally, to print a copy of the email, I need to go to my sent mail folder. So here's the sent mail. Now, I need to make sure I print a copy showing all of the details clearly. So if I click show details here, it shows everything clearly. And I can click on the print button. There we go. And just print it out straight to the printer. And that's the end of this section.